Hey everybody, welcome back to DK Web Design Studio. Today we're gonna look at ChatGPT, how we can use it to augment Facebook advertising copy to come up with really fast, clever copywriting in a fraction of what it would have taken us before this revolutionary technology. Now, we're still gonna use some creativity, we're still gonna be engineering some different prompts so that we can get the right output that we're looking for using language, using that natural process to define the problem statement, define the target audience, and really make a compelling advertisement pitch. Now let's jump right into how do you do this with ChatGPT, and I'm gonna go straight into it. So the first thing we wanna do is, I'm gonna grab this, I've already written it out, is the first prompt. The first prompt is to tell the tool to give you advertising copy. Now notice I wrote high converting. We don't just want ad copy, we want something that's a little bit more optimized. So I, I put that um, adjective in there to essentially uh, help to shape the sentence and generate that output that we're looking for. Text copy organized by main header, body footer, designed to convert viewers to click on an ad in order to get a free ebook. When you're creating ads, you don't want to just advertise a product that has a cost right away. You want to funnel people in either into a webinar, into a free offering, an ebook, a free training. That's going to then develop a little bit more of a relationship before someone commits to throwing money and paying for your product. If you are well recognized and trusted already, then you could just go straight into your uh, paid product. You don't have to go into necessarily any kind of funnel uh, to build that relationship. But that aside, we're starting off from scratch here. So we're going to create that lead magnet and advertise it. And so this is what we're trying to pitch right now. Click on the ad in order to get a free ebook to learn how to invest in stocks, ETFs, and mutual funds. And then I threw in invest in options trading as well. And I'm looking for five different high converting ads. Typically, when you're running a Facebook ad or Instagram ad, you want to have an A-B test. You don't want to just go all your eggs in one basket. So I'm doing five designs. I'm going to look at which one's optimizing, which one is optimizing for click-through rate and through, and most importantly, what's generating those sales, what's actually getting people to convert, put in their email to get that copy of the ebook. And then we're going to go put more emphasis on those high-performing ads. So we generate five in this thought process, in this approach. Now, the other thing I put here is a header, a main section, and a footer. So the ad, when we're thinking about a picture ad, we want to have an organization to it. You want some caption that's going to grab attention. You want to describe what it's about a little bit in text. You can do this in, in your text box or your description field alternatively, but I like to put a little bit more text on the pictures and call to action, the footer, some kind of, you know, learn now, invest now, that sort of thing. So let's see what ChatGPT comes up with. I'm gonna hit enter, and here you go. Ad number one, learn to invest in stocks, ETFs, mutual funds, get a free ebook now. Notice the call to action. Um, and it's gonna keep on generating really, and they're all kind of different a little bit. Click here to get your free ebook. Um, it looks like actually all the footers are the same in this example, but we can tell ChatGPT to um, change the footers so that each one is different. So if you don't get exactly what you want, you can keep, it's gonna remember your conversation. So you can tell it to um, alternate and give you some alternatives to what you had put in initially. You can see, take your first steps towards building wealth. That's a great catch line for selling an ebook on learning how to invest in stocks, ETFs, and mutual funds. Um, and so now I have all these cool different ideas, ready to take control of your financial future. Um, and we can start with this and then tweak it, tailor it down to exactly what we need. All right, let's look at the next part of the prompt. The next thing I wanna do is, this is a lot of ad copy. I don't wanna put all that in a in a um, picture advertisement. So I'm telling it to become much more concise, optimize it to be short and fit on a Facebook ad image. Let's see what happens.
All right, good. So it still is alternating the footers. It's giving us different examples for each of those footers. Ready to invest, free ebook. Grow your wealth, free ebook. Invest with confidence, free ebook. So the free invest with confidence, we're leading on to uh, convert somebody who's interested in trying to learn about these different topics. Um, our free ebook on stocks, ETFs, mutual funds, and option trading will teach you how to build your wealth over time. Get your free copy today. So lots of different alternatives. Now, the next thing we want to do in the very last step, now that it fits on a picture, is to target the demographic that we want. So here I'm saying write this again, but target it to novice investors, people that are just starting out. Alternatively, I could ask it to target it to expert investors that are very familiar with the language and the jargon of investing. Um, and it's going to create different results based on those prompts. So if I say target it again, let's see what it comes up with. Let me start at the top. Don't know where to start with investing. Somebody that's a novice doesn't know where to start. Ready to start investing but not sure where to begin. Investing doesn't have to be scary. That's really good. So all of these are really clever and they're not 100% perfect, but this is now a template that I can grab, copy it, and paste it into a Upwork or Fiverr gig to have somebody, a designer, generate these pictures for me. Or if I'm a graphic designer already, which I am, I can now start each of my pictures with this text, um, go on Canva, go on Photoshop, uh, use GIMP, whatever your editing software tool is, and start to craft really high converting Facebook ads. So I have just basically saved myself a few hours of typing and editing and brainstorming and research, and I've done it in literally about three to five minutes. So hopefully this could be a huge time saver for any one of you that are doing uh, Facebook advertisements for your clients or you're trying to advertise your own business. You know, this channel is for business owners, it's for people that are trying to start and do things on their own, you know, whether they're building a Wix website, creating email marketing campaigns, paid advertisements, still a big niche and big industry. So get it going. Hope this was helpful. Leave me a comment, like, subscribe to the channel for more engaging content. I'm gonna move more into these AI tools because they're really game changers for a lot of the workflows that we do. Still you're gonna have to be very creative. You're still gonna have to rely on your own strategy and think carefully and strategically, but use these tools to optimize and 10X your approach. Peace.